right. Where next? I mean, we've done everywhere at least once. Let's do... That one. Try and have a look at the uh, uh, the thing that's actually the center. Bugger off, Sarkos. Right, where am I? Right, which bit's actually got the centre in it? Oh, two off. Just sit this way. Ah, oh, we're seeing steam coming up now. How's oh, that mate boosted? Yeah, that's there it is. Lots of mega piranhas down there. Down here, I suppose. Oh, that's a bit of a drop. Sharks. Drop now because of that height, you fall deep, don't you? Beam coming down as well. Shame that ice cube's there because that would make a cracking screenshot. In quite a few screenshot worthy places on this uh, adventure today. mist and everything down here from all these waterfalls all the way around. It's a hell of a sight of a place though. A slowly float up. Alright, so that must be the way that you properly walk down then. 
you don't do the stupid thing what I did and just jump off anyway. Shame that water doesn't actually fall on it and then flow down that. I'd imagine that's one thing I thought probably quite a bitch in development though, water physics. And I've got um just like nothing can hurt me at the moment, I've got like just invincibility on just just while I have a look at the map. Just so the whole stream pretty much isn't me just dying and then running back to where I was to look at the new map and then and then coming back and then dying again. That that would just be like, a bit repetitive and tedious, but otherwise I don't use console commands very much. Wow, that water's running fast. Luckily, it doesn't drag you, Flemnac. That'll be horrible. Move. Flemnac, there's a full on fight going on there, isn't there? Brawl. Scorpions, saber cats, chickens. Shame it's not day cycle. What time is it? Actually, it's getting a day cycle. Just dark in this area anyway. Oh, Alright, so I'm actually in the middle of this floating island now. This place is pretty cool, look at this. This is on like a floating island as well. Beaver. Oh, it's pretty dangerous looking though in here if you're like just running in. Just for an explore. I mean, there's chickens in here. That looked like there was a carno over there somewhere. See, this is what I mean. Freeze, freeze. There, uh, then we'll go in a full frame rate again. This must be like just a general sync with the um, the system. Get some height and have a look. Look at that view. Take all these off the hotbar just so the hotbar will disappear. Just might want to get a few cheeky screenshots here. Come on, put your hands down, son. On. All right. That view. Straight down over there, just the full bank there. Right, that must have been where I've just run up. Oh no, I've just run up through in the, the big place. That's the big waterfall. Okay, so you can spiral downwards as well. I've run just around the edge of the water there. So this whole like floating sort of rock place is hollow. Seems to have like a few tiers to it. Down and then right the way down the bottom there, the trees are. Big sort of spring in the middle. Down and down and then down again. Seem to be getting higher somewhere here. What's this way? I could walk up there but it doesn't seem to lead to anywhere. All these little crystal nodes as well, they look awesome. That one might have lead us somewhere actually, let's try that one.
you know, I'm really thinking I'm going to start getting back into this game now. I can find a, a decent server. Ah, how's it raining inside a cave? I can find a decent server though on this um, map. I think I'm going to start getting back into this. Ah, there's a cracking view. This whole cave is awesome. Right, so we're getting higher up here. It's still raining inside, which is just backwards to me, but... I'm surprised that happens, because they seem to manage to have caves pretty decent on the original map. Like, you didn't get this happen on them. But then again, I suppose it is... When you think about it, it's a DLC that's still an alpha platform, so... Look at that. Oh dear. So I just toppled off that edge. Does this lead anywhere? No. Actually. Does it? No. Just a lot of um, metal rocks. Does that go somewhere? Anything like this? It's just a way in from the top. Ah. Oh, wow. I don't know what's down there. This might have been just one of the ramps that I missed before and I just skipped thinking it led nowhere. See if I can wait for that light and a flash and get another screen grab. Ah, oh, I missed it. Never mind. Right, so this is what I got the screenshots on the thingy the Steam page is, like the store page for this DLC is of this area. That was pretty scary. Alright, oh, so this is the bottom of the inside way. I'm not sure if there's any way to walk straight up from in here though. That really messes with me. Not flown, not speed upwards. Well, that's because this, I mean, this doesn't have to be sort of physically accurate. I mean, it's a big floating rock anyway. Ah, oh, yeah, and then back up to the snow biome.
Oh God. That though. Oh God. I thought I fell all the way down there. And again, let's just jump. Oh, I'm still running around with no pants on. Didn't realise that. I've crafted the hide gear a few times today and the cloth gear a few times. Oh, right, that's where I jumped on before. Where do I want to go next? I think I want to go... Straight up there. And then this will probably be the last bit I'll look at. I mean, I haven't done the lava island very much, but I can easily add that in another stream. So many screenshot worthy places on this whole map. Happy snappy. Oh, is that thing just gonna walk straight off the edge? Oh no, it's stopped. That island over there as well. Get all these uploaded onto my Steam as well. Yeah, I'll probably upload them onto the online library because some of them are just really nice screenshots. Oh, that insta freezing. That could be screenshot worthy as well. All those like rock ballads. Screenshots I don't always get to get a hold of as well, probably unless you use commands. The wrecks there. That island's full of wrecks and carnos and anything that wants to eat your face basically will be out that island. Oh, that's, that's just a drop. That must be a lava trickle as well, is it? Yeah. A western lava trickle from that island. A few water sources on that island as well. Though. Must have to have a pretty tanky tribe on set up to want people to build on that island, never mind be able to maintain it. Right, so this is what this island looks like. It's pretty much a, um, like a path directly up where it seems to spiral around from what I can see so far. Definitely a screenshot. But yeah, from what I can see, yeah, that's pretty um damn standard. Oh wow, is that the edge of the map? Must be the edge of the map, so if you if you fall off there you're screwed. 
So yeah, that's that's what I'm looking at then. That's that's the end of the map. Yeah, like the end of the world. What a quality idea. Yeah, it's starting to hurt from cool anyway, so let's let's take a run. Oh wow. I'm not taking any screen grabs just at the moment because uh of the hurtingness. Think. Ah. Oh. I'll get up the freezing zone yet. Dire wolves. The pop shield that mammoth, nice big white rex there. Don't know what it is, but the the white ones and the black ones look just so badass. Plain white and the plain black. <laughs> what? That's backwards. What's in this? Generate yes. I don't know what was on that. Absolutely nothing important, but Oh well. I should have done that. Let's get them wrecked by this thing. Oh. Can I make it to this? Almost. Right, we've had a look. Screw it. That's what I wanted to do. Something's already fell. Random rhino. Timber! I think that's going to be a great way to finish off. Just take my own knife there, just corn it. But yeah, I'm well into that. That's an awesome map. Awesome map. If I can play a server on that, I'll be happy, happy days.